Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, and today I have a brand new episode for you. Today we are playing some more Lifeboat City, and in this video, I'm actually going to be showing you all how to get the Iron Axe, as you can tell from the description. Um, basically, you have to do a bit of a glitch to get it. If you come on down to the lumber mill, you get yourself up here, and you come over to where all these uh, iron bars are. You'll see that there are two chests lying here, okay? You'll see that there's one on the left, and there's one on the right. Now, you cannot just simply walk inside of here all willy-nilly. They trick you by putting a ladder there, making you think you can walk in here, but you cannot. So, what you have to do is get yourself the Pantheon 5000. Or I believe it's 4000. Um, here, let me just check. I believe, I believe it's the Pantheon 4000. Pardon me one minute. check here. Yes, the Pantheon 5000. You get yourself this lovely car. If you do not have it, go back and watch my other video and you shall have it. But once you do, you can drive up those stairs there and come on through this middle column and try to get yourself through the bars, position yourself, exit the car, and you will be in here. And by the time you manage to glitch yourself into this place, if you click this left chest here... Uh, one second. Why isn't it... Come on now. Don't be like this. You're working perfectly fine before. Okay. <laughs> Come on now. Don't, don't lag on me now. Oh my. It just does not seem to want to work for us. And my fat, sweaty palms keep hitting the side of it. Alright, let's go here. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead, and we're gonna switch out of this third-person view. I could have done it much earlier, but I'm just way too lazy. Alright, so if we go here, and we click this right chest, oh my. If we go here with an empty hand, of course, <laughs> we go and click this right chest, and it is, is it because we're crouching? It was because we were crouching the entire time. <laughs> Alrighty. So if we go here and we grab this uh, beautiful iron axe, you can now use it um, as you like. You know, of course, the preferred option is to cut trees with it. But, uh, of course, it serves for some very good protection, and you can kill zombies very easily with it. Um, to get yourself out of here, you can simply go and return to spawn. Once you have done that, you can go and show the world your brand new shiny iron axe, and no one, absolutely no one, will want to mess with you when you have an axe as fine as this. So, let's take a nice look at it. Here we go. You got your nice iron axe in Lifeboat City, and now you are protected, and that is what it feels like to be powerful. So, that concludes the end of this video. I thank you very much for watching, and I hope you all enjoy. Make sure to get your little fill on Lifeboat City while you're here. May you do the car quest and the plane quest if you have the funds. And I hope you all enjoy your day. Have a lovely time. Bye-bye.